it seems that Ultron's search for a suitable host body activated more than just Ultima. I thought you said that Ultron couldn't control any more machines from inside the stone. He cannot. But once activated, some programming cannot be stopped until its prime directive is achieved. Prime directive? What prime? Targets Sentinels. And I know just where they're headed. X marks the spot. Destroy all mutants. Destroy all mutants. Yeah, not today, Tovaris. Comrade, heads up! Uh, and eyes wide open. Save some for us, my friend. Why should you always get to have all the fun? compatriots either you're here about the item of infinite cosmic power we just liberated from the Hellfire Club or oh is it taco night again Come now, Cyclops. When has following you ever done our kind any good? You've allied yourselves with humans. The same race who designed these monstrosities to hunt us. Pathetic. This is about far more than us versus them, Eric. We need to put our differences aside and work together for once. There are much larger forces at play here. I am aware. My contacts inside the Hellfire Club inform me about the artifacts your X-Men stole from them. As expected, you vastly underestimated its power. 
That is a mistake you have made far too often, boy. Release him at once! As you wish. After all, I did not come here for a fight. Only to claim the power that is rightfully mine. If the X-Men will not fall by my hand, then I will watch as all that they hold dear crumbles to the ground around them. You got it, boss. This performance is gonna bring the house down. And there ain't nothing that can stop me! Taco! Taco night! We're gonna eat while the X-Men fight! Yeah! Yeah, it's going just as Okay, that's it. Someone's about to get a kick square in the chimichangas. Yeah. I'm told this is the most secure room in the mansion. I'd say you'll be safer in here. But that would be a lie. I can't survive in there forever. I'll make sure of that. A new era for mutant kind is about to dawn. Such a pity that none of you will live to see it. Say that. We have tracked you across the great void to retrieve what was stolen from us. Return the Infinity Stones to us at once, or suffer for all eternity. Yeah, right. Like handing them over to your boss is going to lead to less suffering. He's gonna use them to rip the universe to shreds. And since we live in the universe, well, I'm sure you understand our concern. You only delay the inevitable. Thanos shall have the stones. Even if we must pry them from your dead hands. Hmm. On second thought... Hmm. Perhaps an alliance is called for after all. <laughs> Imbeciles! You barely survived facing me alone. What makes you think you could ever defeat two of us? <laughs> A brilliant observation, Liebchen. Danke. Huh? Proxima! Once you have fallen, your insignificant planet shall follow! No. Save that moment of glory for our master. My beloved! Ah! 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 
and let me have mine instead. You dare harm a member of the Black Order? Perhaps we have not been clear enough about the gravity of your situation. Allow me to remedy that now. Even with this stone at my command, this may not be a battle we can win. If we used all of the stones together, however... We would almost certainly do more damage than good. What we need is time to regroup, to formulate a better plan, as far from here as possible. I have never teleported so many at once, but I can attempt to... No, Kurt. Not even Lockjaw could get us all far enough away from this insanity. <laughs> As long as their prize is in our hands, these monsters will follow us to the ends of the universe. This universe, perhaps? Something has been weakening the barriers between dimensions. If I can just break through... There. But I must warn you. Chaos magic is unpredictable. I do not know where this will lead us. At the moment, dearest Wanda, uh, anywhere is better than here. <laughs> the rift is sealed. We're safe now. Alas, if only I could be so certain. in any time now, darlings. These monsters won't hunt themselves. Doctor, I'm so glad you're here. Something is wrong. These portals... They're getting bigger? No. That must be a mistake. The spell you're casting... It, it's expanding the rift! You have to stop! I cannot cease until all realities are one. So I am commanded by the dread Dormammu. Dormammu. Be gone by the flames of the Faltine! I purge your dark soul from my own! Oh no, dear doctor. I have not finished with you yet.
That was quite an impressive feat. But vanquishing the true Dormammu in his own realm will be nearly impossible. Lucky for us. The impossible is my specialty. <laughs> the Kingpin had no idea the power he possessed. But I've been watching. And I now know what these crystals can do. In more experienced hands. Here. Let me show you. You are victorious. Take your spoils. I must admit, this alliance you've built is quite inspiring. <laughs> Perhaps I should craft one of my own. Hmm. <laughs> Right, Runa. Dormammu feeds off this dimension's endless arcane energies. He can't die in this place. But we most definitely can. And if Dormammu spills this black magic into our world, he would be unstoppable there, too. Of course, without the Reality Stone, he can't merge our dimensions together. And without the darkness to fuel him, he wouldn't last long. So, if I can open a portal back to our plane of existence, perhaps we can take the stone somewhere safe. <gasps> or at least, somewhere safer than this. We came here to escape the chaos of Earth. Our people were trapped at the heart of far too many conflicts over the centuries. Assailed from all sides by those who wish to harm or exploit us. Only by removing ourselves from their world could we ever truly hope to find peace. So, tell us, my dear sister. Why have you opened our doors to the same chaos we fought so hard to leave behind? No matter how we may try to cut ourselves off from our home planet, my queen, we still have friends and allies who need our help. Who are we to ignore their plight? We are inhumans. As both humans and mutants alike have repeatedly reminded us. We stand alone. And unless your friends can convince the king otherwise... So do they. Find him. Thane! Gorgon has been gravely wounded. You must attend to him immediately. Uh, 
I'll see what I can do, Your Majesty. There you go, big guy. This should stop the bleeding. Before you know it, you'll be back on your feet. Oh, hooves. Some sort of amber. Intriguing. I don't believe we've had the pleasure, young man. Huh? Oh. Few have. Thane came to us from the inhuman colony of Orlan, seeking sanctuary. Sanctuary? Hmm. From what, pray tell? Not what, but rather who? My father. Turns out he's a maniacal alien warlord bent on universal domination. And for some reason, he really wants me dead. His name is Thanos. If you're lucky, you've never heard of him. Luck hasn't exactly been on our side today, my boy. But I have a feeling that may be about to change. Where am I? Somewhere safe. I'll try to rest and... No. Nowhere in Ottoman is safe. I remember now. He's lost his twisted mind. Again. Oh, come now, cousin. <laughs> Is that any way to talk about the new king of the Inhumans? <laughs> You may have power, but you lack imagination. It is time that someone with true vision took the throne. This is Winter Soldier, broadcasting on the Avengers emergency frequency. Again. If anyone is listening out there, my mission to infiltrate AIM was a success. At least until Modok and his nerd squad somehow recovered a bona fide Infinity Stone. I wasn't about to wait around and find out what they planned to do with it. So I blew my cover and grabbed their rock. I'm approaching a secure location with a stone in hand. But it won't take long for those eggheads to figure out where I'm headed and try to take it back. So, if you can hear this, Avengers, lock on to these coordinates and swing on by. It'd be a shame to be stuck in paradise all alone. I am told that AIM only worships science. But if any of you believe in the goddess, now would be the time to start praying. One step further, fools, or you'll be crashing harder than the Winter Soldier. Oh well, it was sound advice, but if you won't listen, I can make you! <laughs> and it will be the last thing you ever hear. <clears throat> the noise came from over here. Sounded like a gamma bomb went off. In these jungles, it could be anything. You speak the truth. <clears throat> so it is best to beware. Lest the hunters become the prey. Can't let you go any further, I'm afraid. Modok still has plans for this one. And if he gets his prize, 
I get mine. Wakanda's throne. You may think you've won, but you haven't heard the last of me! Ambush! Aim forces are closing in. If you're hoping to stop Modok, you need to go now. I mean it! In there, I'm just a liability. A weapon Aim can use against you. Let me buy you the time to finish the mission I couldn't. Don't worry about me. I've taken down the Red Skull. A few guys in beekeeper suits should be no problem. Now go! Stand back, friends. The Dora Milaje have this situation under control. There are forces at play here your feeble minds cannot begin to comprehend. Nothing is under your control. Not even the concentration of psionic energy that you call a soul. This stone, so much power, I must have them all! Fetch them for me, won't you, my dears? I have matters of great scientific importance that require my immediate attention. Centuries of knowledge are etched into these walls. Ancient Wakandans called it magic. But there is no such thing. There is only science. It bends to my will. Now, so shall you. And then... The world! The knowledge found here will grant me access to an endless supply of souls on which my stone may feast. But first... <laughs> An appetizer! How delicious! <laughs> Who's next? <laughs> already have, Modok, but you did succeed in one thing. You stirred the ancient warriors that reside here in this city of the dead. The Necropolis is now their home, just as Wakanda is mine. And we shall protect our homes at any cost. <laughs> In the name of science! <laughs> no, not science, Modok. Something far greater. Far, far greater. Your Majesty, if I may. Yes, of course. No man is fit to wield such power unchecked. Not even a king. Each of these stones is capable of shattering worlds on their own. Just imagine what they could do together. Yes. Just imagine. So, what do we do with the Infinity Stones now? We must take action to ensure that they do not fall into the wrong hands. Yeah. <laughs> 
There is only one hand on which they belong. The hand of Thanos. Wow, these losers just don't quit, do they? And thankfully, neither do you. If not for your efforts, we would have been forced to gather each of the stones ourselves. I will make certain that our master celebrates what you've done here. In your eulogies. This door will not hold them for long. Then we stand and fight. Until the end. What is this place? Thanks to Wakanda's ancient priests, the walls of the necropolis not only detail ancient history, they also give us a glimpse of the future. If it's literally set in stone, then how can we change it? As long as there's hope, there's always a chance, son. Ah, but he's not your son. Now is he? No. No matter how he tries to hide it, this one has a familiar aroma about him. The sweet smell of death. I have heard whispers of you, Thane. My master's lost progeny. How proud he will be to have you by his side. He's already chosen which side he stands on. Then let him fall on it as well. I said, until the end. Wait! You came here for the stones, not for their lives. Thane, what are you? Take the stones. And if you must take a life, take mine. Just spare theirs. <laughs> Thanos shows no mercy to those who oppose his will. Thanos is not here. Huh? His son is. And we accept his offer. Treacherous fool. <sighs> This shall not stand! Perhaps the child is right. The stones are the true prize. With such power at our command, these heroes are nothing more than fleas. Death by our hands is not an honor they have earned. They deserve something much worse. seen anything like this the center of the universe the birthplace of the stones the heart of infinity how fitting then that the place where all things began is where your pathetic existence will finally come to an end. Where 
this universe will be mine alone to destroy, child. Even if I must save it from you first! <laughs> to me! You did this to yourself, boy. The second that you believed you could surpass me, your fate was sealed. But the armor... That armor is a curse. Far too powerful for any mortal being to contain. There's a reason I chose to wear only one of its gloves. You knew. Of course. And more importantly, I knew better. We have to do something. There is nothing that can be done. He's just a boy. A boy who tried to be a god and failed. But perhaps we are not that different after all. What are you doing now, tyrant? What I should have done long ago. <laughs> <laughs> Please, father. I am taking away our pain. <laughs> so, I guess we won? Only for now. If I know anything about Thanos, it's that he always finds a way to return. Even from the grave. When he does, we will be ready. <laughs> Hands off, ugly. You're under arrest by authority of the Nova Corps. You and your Black Order buddies are gonna spend the rest of your lives in the kiln for what you've done. It looks like your boss won't be around to break you out this time. Thanos and Thane may be out of play, but the Stones are not. And as long as they're still together, the threat they pose is too great. Then we split them up. <laughs>